Hello, everybody! Hello! Welcome to another reaction, stinky reaction video. Stinky? Yeah, we're doing another stinky reaction video. We're a reaction channel now. We are. No, we're not. We're not gonna, we're not gonna become a reaction channel. Okay, so, this time we're doing Markiplier's semi-new, wait, when, two months ago. We are totally, we jumped right on it when it came out. We were like, yes, we need to do this. It was so important to us. We are doing a Markiplier Choose Your Own Adventure. It's one of the smaller ones. You might not know about it, actually. It's called the Wharfstash Automated Interview Automaton, or the Yeah Yeah for short. <laughs> and so me and Elias only watched like the first, the first couple things, and they were like, "Yeah, we should do this on the Chan." So we're doing on doing it on the Chan, and we're just gonna. Uh, we should have. We could. If we had more viewers, we could have done this on stream and had people vote for what we do. But we're, we'll be doing a couple paths. It's basically just going to be a 15-minute episode. Uh, after the video ends, there's probably going to be a card to Mark's original video that you should definitely go watch, but after you see us react to it. Yeah. We're going to play it now. So, yeah. We'll just watch the beginning scene, and then we'll choose. same building as that thing, I tell you me. Anyway, thank you, whoever you are, for agreeing to test out the Wharfstash Automated Interview Automaton, or for short. Let's start off with some quick calibration. All you need to do is sit back, relax, and listen for some numbers. Okay? Here we go. Alright, listen for numbers. Numbers? Good numbers. Keep in mind, I have no idea what you're actually going to say due to the fact that, as I said before, this message is pre-recorded. But if you did hear something, now would be the time to speak up. Wait, 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 wait. Don't wait. be shy. I'm sure we nothing need to, bad we need to move. Move. I don't know what you're going to say, so if it does happen, it will happen, and if it doesn't happen, it won't happen. That's how deterministic reality works. I think I heard numbers. I think I heard numbers. It was one, two, four. Or two, one. Two, one, four, actually. I think I heard numbers. Numbers, epic. That's great. Or bad. Not really sure what you said. But I choose to remain positive and assume that you are still alive. Which I am! Our automated friend here is operating well within acceptable murder parameters. We're one step closer to mass production. The world demands more interviews, and I can't be everywhere at once all the time. Only some of the time. Even you might land an interview someday. Maybe, probably not. It depends on how the best few minutes go. On to the next test! Word association! The fundamental basis of any good interview is getting the goods out of those stubborn interviewees. The why will goods. say a word and you just say back the first name popped into your little head. Simple, right? Probably. Good luck! Initializing word association training protocol round one. Please. 
Please respond. Uh. Five. Wait. You didn't say anything. That's the Colonel Steve in the background. Response. Unclear. Increasing aggression. This game. Yeah. Man, this looks great, by the way. He said the thing, Elisha. It was an accident. It was an accident. Okay, let, let's go through. Let's go back. No, we'll go back. Back, Keith. I was wrong. Guess you're not supposed to be honest during an interview. No. You're not supposed to be honest during an interview, Elisha. We should have hotkeys to switch between things. Uh, I just press, press the back button. button, right? I think I heard numbers. And then we just want to choose potato salad. A uh, potato salad? Potato salad. bad. I'm not really sure I just why. muted the thing. All right. Potato salad. Go all the way to the end. Potato salad. salad. Yeah, we don't choose don't the choose ones. Don't choose the shorter ones. The with short. Yeah, don't choose the short ones. It's a lesson we learned from that. It's the Colonel Steve. Response accepted. Yay! Association training protocol complete. Nurse, dearest next of kin, I regret to inform you that your dearly beloved and almost despised has regrettably, but not unexpectedly, become recently deceased in the line of duty. Be comforted in the knowledge the that their demise was just as likely to be quick and painless as it was slow and agonizing. Please do not respond to this voicemail as the number has already been disconnected. <laughs> Alright, that's do it for the death scenario. Now on to uh, the survivors. Wow, potato salad, a real thing for you. But the test has been passed with flying colors and you're still alive. And speaking of flying colors, our next test is about something called um, synthetic linguistics. That sounds made up. But the point is, you can have a good interview if the warrior isn't able to conjure up the right words in the right situations. So our friend is going to fire off some random words, and you just try to spot anything that doesn't make any sense. All right? Although, pretty much everything isn't going to make any sense, because all random words... I believe in you! Initializing speech training protocol. that needs to be done for now anyway. All systems are most likely nominal at this point, unless I'm speaking to a pile of quivering meat that's been robotically smooshed into the floor. Either way, we're gonna take this bad boy for a spin with a full-on interview. A mock interview, mind you. Don't get too excited. It's not real. 
But there's no reason to wait around for the wire to get bored, so let's keep it nice and limber while you sit back and get ready for the interview of your life. And maybe the last one, too. Have fun! Did Lixian edit this, or did Mark edit this? So that's canon now? That's cool. Dude, it was Mark's fault. It was definitely no. Mark's fault. It was Mark's fault. It was all Mark from the beginning. Wait, why'd you prick yes? Oh, shoot! I want to go back. I want to go back. <laughs> What's your observation? Oh, my observation was that, uh... Uh, he's, he's talking faster. He's not, like, robot -y as much. You can change the past. You can tell all the stories you want to tell. It won't change what happened. You can't rewrite the past. If you live in fantasy forever, then you lose yourself in the story. Potato salad. Right answer. That was a titillating interview for sure. That we are out. Thank you for joining me tonight. Say safe goodbye. Oh, the emotions, the passion, the fury. He's just like me, my sweet baby boy. Well, he should be anyway. He's a perfect scan of my noggin, so he better be a chip off the old block. Hey, you! Oh, what a supporting role! Fantastic, I guess. Still not sure you're alive, but I am grateful whether you've been torn to shreds or are merely drowning in your own tears. Magnificent! And now that testing is done, we can finally bring this monstrosity to the main stage. I'm sure you'll be seeing a lot more of the wire soon. Very, very soon. Now get out. And I'm feeling you for any blood you got on my robot. Have a nice day, Papa. And then it links back to chapter one. All right. So, recap. What did we learn? That was an emotional, big kind of bite. Yeah. To chew. So apparently. Wolford Wharfstash took a 
perfect scan of his noggin and put it into an automaton. And now the automaton's like, wait. I killed people? Yeah. So um. Maybe Warf Stash feels guilty after all? Or maybe the robot feels guilty yeah. because he's not Warf Stash. He's not Warf Stash. That's true. But whatever. Okay, so that was done really well. I liked yeah. it. It was small, it was sweet, it was short, it was sweet, but it was done really well. Yes. I love the uh, who, what, when, who, when, where, why, what, am, I. That was cool. Uh, but like... Someone's driving a motorcycle. So, uh, uh, that was done really well. It's canon now, too. So, Mark said the reason why Mark died... ...by Mark, after Mark died... ...was because they... ...they were both drunk, but Mark not really. And Mark... Uh, convinced Wilford to play Russian roulette with him, and Wilford didn't know the gun was loaded, so he shot Mark. And Mark died. And Mark died. So, I don't know. The Who Killed Markiplier universe, if you're not into it, it's really interesting. You should go watch this stuff. It's pretty cool. Uh, A Heist with Markiplier is yeah. the best one. But, uh... Yeah, but his other stuff is interesting. His streams where he explains all of it are interesting. And yeah, it's just really cool. Yeah. And Who Killed Markiplier, like the, predis the sequel to it, is in the works. He's filming. He was, he's actually up filming in, no, he's filming in Vancouver for uh, the Edge of Sleep TV show. Yeah. Based on the podcast that he But he's did. doing a lot of writing. But he's doing a lot of writing. I am excited for it. I'm excited for it, too. Looks like it's coming together, and by maybe next year, we'll have it. Yeah. So, yeah. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. Wait, was there anything we else we wanted to just talk about? I don't think so. Uh, oh, yeah. I just... Distractable. The Distractable podcast is really good. But, Yeah. That's all. You're free to draw your own conclusions. We'll probably marinate over... I'm probably going to marinate over this and then draw... Then bring my conclusions when we... Do the rest of the videos for this mm -hmm. week. So, you know, we shall see you... In the next one. one. Next time on Lower Your Expectations. Bye. Goodbye!